is May the 18th is Saturday, Preakness. Getting ready to run the second leg of the Kentucky Derby. And I'm getting ready to get rid of Governor O'Malley. This is an impeach Governor O'Malley page. And this is my videos that I got about impeaching Governor O'Malley. All right. These are the movies I've been making. And we're talking about the corruption under Ed Norris, Governor O'Malley, zero tolerance, stop and frisk. Like I said, I was doing a documentary in Letters to My President. This is me. This is Letter to My President. Dear President Barack Obama, I respectfully request a federal investigation concerning the American prison industry and the judicial system as a whole. This is my 13th letter to you since 2007. And close is some material to ensure that these there is no misunderstandings concerning my request. I have a federal case against Governor O'Malley and 52 public elected officials in Maryland and Illinois. It deals directly with the corruption in the courts and the pay-to-play politics in Maryland and Illinois, mainly Senator Kirk's directly district, Lake County, Illinois. I'm a whistleblower and a federal case is GLR 123570. You have evidence and legal material needed for my case. Richard McFeely, Rod Rosenstein, Patrick Fitzgerald have been blocking the investigation that you requested on May 8, 2008. As President of the United States of America, you have a moral and ethical obligation to protect my rights under the Constitution. You took an oath of office to protect my rights. You gave Americans the audacity of hope. I'm running for the office of Lieutenant Governor of the State of Maryland as a black Republican. And Governor O'Malley had me locked up because he was, because I was exposing the corruption in the Jim Crow justice. In closing, I hope I made my point clear. I need all the DVDs I sent you from my federal case and trial as evidence. Respectfully submitted, Dwayne G. Davis. Care to Eric Holder, of the Department of Justice, Chief Justice Roberts and Benjamin Jealous of the NAACP. That's the White House, all right? So it ain't no misunderstandings. That's the whistleblowers act, like I said, and you've seen the material I got. I gave you my receipt for filing for candidacy. So that's political prosecution by a Democratic to stop a Republican. Like I said, this is the White House. We have a relationship. We have a, a, a physical relationship, that's me. And that shows you in October of 2012 that they responded to my last mail. So we're going to take this all the way back to Ed Norris, CBS Radio, and we're going to have mainstream media held accountable for what they do and don't do pertaining to the corruption here. You can't have Ed Norris getting out of jail and getting a good job and locking me up for doing nothing. Crime and justice, dog. It ain't going to be just us.